everybody and happy Tuesday. You might not know what that one means, but we are going to do our cocoa and cookies a little late this week. Go make sure you grab your favorite cup of hot cocoa, a few of your favorite cookies, pull up a chair, and sit and chat with me a while in today's episode of Cocoa and Cookies. you had a great weekend. We are doing Cocoa and Cookies a day late today. It is Tuesday, but we are just getting home. If you followed the channel throughout the weekend, then you know that we have had a very busy time, a fun time, but busy nonetheless. Yesterday was Monday, and we got up super early, left Pensacola, and headed all the way down to Daytona Beach, Florida, which is about an hour and 15 minutes south of where we actually live. But we had a banquet to attend. Our youth students, for those of you who might not know, I know that several of you are new to the channel this week. For those of you who do not know, my husband and I are youth pastors at our church and our youth students this past year raised $3,000 for missions, which was awesome. So we were invited down to the missions banquet to receive a little plaque in their honor. So we drove straight through to attend that last night and by the time we left the service and the dinner and all that kind of stuff I guess it was probably around 11:30, maybe closer to midnight when we finally got home so we have been on the run <laughs> and we are all pretty worn out today unfortunately for my husband he did have to get up and head back to work he's been off since last Thursday when we left town and so he headed back in this morning. So poor guy, I talked to him just a little bit ago and he is definitely worn out. So I have a feeling when he gets off at five o'clock and gets here, it's just going to be a chill night around the Rose household. Probably watch some movies or something like that and just chill out and try to catch our breath. It was a very fun weekend. A lot of you guys traveled with us and for that I want to say thank you. We had several of you guys that were watching the vlogs all weekend long and many of you left your congratulations for my daughter and for that I also want to say thank you. We really appreciate that a lot. It means a lot to us to know that we have people all over the place. Some of you guys are just all over the country that we have been able to gain a little bit of a relationship with and that you sent your well wishes. So thank you very much for that. We truly appreciate it. Other than that, not a whole lot going on today. Obviously, we're just trying to play catch up. I got up this morning and we got home late. Like I said, we were exhausted. We came in and just threw suitcases all over the floor. <laughs> and I got up this morning and walked out of my bedroom and looking through the house, through the living room and on the kitchen counter, I thought, man, my house has not looked this much like a disaster since we had the ceilings ripped out for the reconstruction. It looked awful this morning when I got up. So definitely going to be unpacking all that and getting ready to wash all the clothes and you know the typical stuff that you have when you travel. Traveling sometimes can look so glamorous and when people see that you're on the road a lot they think oh man it must be so fun to travel a lot and go to see new places and it is but it's also a lot of work when you get back home because somebody has to take care of all the aftermath. So anyway definitely going to be working on that. I wanted to give a little shout out. It seems as though on the channel here I have gained a new fan so I Dan if you happen to be watching today sending a little shout out your way and giving you a big thank you most of the comments from Ike have been blocked up until now and I'm not so sure I may go and unblock those comments Dan because it seems like you must really be in love with the channel you have been watching every video and you have been making sure to leave me some quite interesting comments down there so I have to say thank you for that because there are other people who are following this channel that aren't quite so dedicated to watch 
as often as you are. Not sure who you are. I know you don't make videos, but it would be quite interesting, I believe, if you did. So anyway, thank you. I have taken notice of that and of your support for the channel. And I also do want to say a big thank you to all of you who are new here. Some of you may not have yet found the cocoa and cookies because I know there are different reasons why some of you are here. Some of you really just kind of like to watch the DIY. Some of you are more interested in the hauls. Some of you are more interested in the couponing information. Speaking of which, I do have a whole playlist, the Couponing 101, giving you some tips and tricks on couponing and some of the ins and outs because believe it or not, there are a lot of rules to couponing that I quite frequently see other couponers breaking and yeah, they may be getting a good deal or making talk a cashier into doing something that they really shouldn't do, but the bottom line and the reality is, is that there are some couponing ethics that should be followed. So I do have a playlist for that for those of you that are here for the coupons and some of you are just here, here for the nail art of which I have not even had time lately. Matter of fact, my nails are in such horrible shape. Uh, just being neglected, been so busy, but there are many of you that are new and I want to say welcome and thank you for joining the family. I hope that you enjoy it here. This channel doesn't really have a main focus, I guess you would say. It's just a conglomeration of everything. Whatever hits my fancy that I want to share with you guys is what I will post because I love to help you guys out, whether it's in saving money, finding good clearance deals, organization around your home, whatever it may be. Anything that I think might can help you out or make your life a lot easier, that's what you'll find here. So, Welcome to all of you who have come. Many of you did watch the collaboration that we all posted on Sunday. If you haven't yet watched that collaboration, then I strongly encourage you to do that. I did team up with 11 other channels, and actually I believe there's going to be 12, because there was another lady who was not able to participate at first, whose video should be up this afternoon on her channel, so I think that's going to make 13 channels total of all the ladies that have joined in with me just to share with you all our stories of maybe some difficult things that we have faced, insecurities, low self-esteem, bullying, different things that maybe we have walked through. And by the end of the summer, we are going to conclude our stories with telling you guys what we did and able to overcome those and to walk with a lot more confidence now to be able to step out and do things that we love to do and that we were created to do. So if you guys haven't yet found that or you just decided to skip over it because it didn't seem to pique your interest, I want to encourage you to go back and take a look. It's called the Woman to Woman Collaboration and in the bottom of my video you will find down in the description box the link to all those other channels. There are some amazing stories from several amazing women who have had to overcome some hard times and I am sure that many of you watching will be able to relate and hopefully those stories will be able to resonate with you guys and offer you some hope or maybe you didn't have any hope before. So that's kind of something new that's happening right now throughout the summer months. And other than that, I don't really have a whole lot to discuss today. Nothing real deep anyway, because to be quite honest with you, my brain is kind of just worn out and tired. I didn't feel super tired until probably about the last 20 minutes of our journey last night. And it just kind of started kicking in. And then whenever I woke up this morning, and we actually slept in. I didn't even get up till I believe it was like 10 minutes after 11. Today, I slept in a long time. I guess my body just really was worn out and needed a lot more sleep than I kind of thought that it did. But even when I got up, just still feeling so tired and dragging, trying to get started around here today. It's been quite difficult. So... Guess I can't handle those trips quite the way I used to whenever I was in my 20s. <laughs> it hits me a lot harder now, but extremely fun, just mentally tired. So I'm not going to talk about anything super deep with you guys today. Just kind of shooting the breeze, catching you up, letting you know that we did make it home safely, and that we had a wonderful time, and that we appreciate all of you who took the journey with us. And I also know that several of you guys enjoyed seeing our trip to Lambert's on Sunday. If you guys haven't seen that video, if maybe it didn't catch your attention, 
It's called My Waitress, My Waiter Threw Food at Me. Go and take a look at it because that restaurant is super fun. We just had to show it to you. And hopefully you'll get a chance to check that out one of these days if you're close to an area where they have one of those. So be sure to go and watch that video and take a look. But other than that, that's about it today, guys. Just want to let you know we're home and we're safe and we're happy and we're healthy and everything is good. I hope everything is good with you guys as well. Let me know down below what interesting is happening in your life. Have you kicked your summer off yet or what's going on with you? Anything exciting? How many of you guys have people that are graduating this year? I know It's a Deal has someone that's graduating this year and there was someone else who commented last week that has a daughter graduating, I believe, but I forget who that was. I've had so many comments coming in. But let us know if you're celebrating a graduation this year as well. Congratulations to you. It sure is a lot of fun. Bittersweet, but a lot of fun. And that's it, you guys. I'm going to go ahead and jump off of here and let you go. I'm going to get busy trying to clean this mess up around here and get some kind of order back in this home. Thank you again for joining us this weekend. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.